Hello equestrians and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing something a little bit different, um, a little bit Christmassy. Uh, this is a gift that I have planned for one of my horsey friends. I'm basically doing a winter survival kit for equestrians as um, a surprise present for her. And I thought it would be great to share it with you guys if you're maybe stuck for ideas for Christmas. I know this is running a bit late now, but it would work for birthdays or any kind of special events really even just if you fancied treating a friend you know having a bit of a treat your friend moment <laughs> um, but yeah I think it'll be uh, something that she'll enjoy it's something different and I'm gonna show you guys what I've bought to put this together and and how I'm gonna kind of put it together the things that I've bought for it and everything so yeah without further ado let's get into the video Okay, so the first thing, I got these off of Amazon and they are hamper kits. So I don't know if you'll be able to see that on the GoPro, but the great thing about these is they come with like the cellophane wrap that goes around it, as well as some ribbons and stuff and some like wiggly worms or whatever they're called. So that's the first item that's going in there. So we're going to get this open. Do I open this first? I'll open it up so we can see it a bit better. Oh. <laughs> and these were really inexpensive actually. Inexpensive. I will uh, put the link in the description for these but they've got like a nice hessian inside and then you'll see there got like these things you've got the bow in there should just make it look very Christmassy very pretty so we've got those and I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna display things yet but we will figure that out next thing I've got is um, my friend loves um, mermaids basically so I've kind of gone a little bit mermaidy themed but everything has a, a purpose as to why it's been uh, included so this is a tangle teasing brush and the reason I've included this is as many of you might know if you've got oh <laughs> if you've got long hair like myself um, and it's quite thick or well just hair in general in the winter months doesn't do well when you're an equestrian and you're out in the elements all the time so I've got this um, basically to help tame the frizz and the knots that we all get in the wind wet and uh, miserable weather in the winter so that's item number one I've also got some gift tags I'll take them out because I'm gonna label everything I kind of want to put some like cute quotes on there and stuff which I will tell you a little bit about what I'm writing on everything so you can kind of get an idea of how to personalize these things but you could get a little bit of string and some gift tags like this like luggage tags that you can write on and I've got a pen and some scissors handy as you do so we'll put them to one side I've kind of got like everything's just shoved down here at the moment so let me find everything so the next thing I have bought again very reasonable off Amazon is a heat holders headband and I will take this out of the plastic actually because it doesn't look great in there but yeah it's got like it's all fleece lined it's a nice purple color you all know by now probably judging by my channel banner and everything else that I love purple um, and I'm sure Nicole will like this as well yeah it just says ladies one size so I presume one size fits all. Then going with the mermaid theme again, we have got a nail care kit. And the reason I bought this is because your nails go through some stuff in the winter, your nails and your uh, hands. So there's some hand cream in there. It's banana hand cream, which I was like, yes, <laughs> I like the smell of bananas, so that'd be good. But then it also comes with like a nail file, which I thought is handy for when you chip nails, cause let's face it, that happens. 
and just some nail varnish because y'all got to pamper yourselves. <laughs> so that was another reason for doing this is like, I think everyone's guilty of spoiling their horses at Christmas time or like people buy things for people's horses rather than them. And I thought it'd be a bit different to kind of pamper my friend for a change. So we're doing that. What else? There is something that goes with that if I can find it. I have also got some card here um, just because I'm going to write like equestrian survival kit and stick it at the front just so it kind of gives you an idea of what it actually is. Next I have some lip products because again like with the, uh, the hand cream, your hands getting dry during the winter, your lips also really suffer. So I thought it'd be nice to include some more mermaidy themed uh, things in there. So that's that. Just, yeah, really important to keep your lips moisturized. Next thing is a hot chocolate because who doesn't love hot chocolate in, you know, the cold months. But I thought it was also nice to get the Baileys because it's like a proper winter warmer then. Um, obviously this is for a adult. <laughs> So I suggest if you fancy doing this kit for a younger um, a younger person, you obviously wouldn't include the alcohol, but yeah. And I thought this gift set looked quite pretty. Comes with a little stirrer as well, so that you don't get any lumps in your hot chocolate, which is pretty cool. So yeah, that's just a nice way to keep your friends warm and toasty after they've been at the yard for the whole day, getting cold. Aha, so this then goes with the nail care kit so it is a nail scrubbing brush and i know this might sound silly but i know from experience obviously having horses that the dirt you get under your nails is horrific and unless like you physically sit there trying to pick it out disgusting i know or you actually go for a shower and you wash your hair that's when i notice that it comes out otherwise it just <laughs> seems to stick there and obviously, if you're going down to do your horse every day, you're gonna get it in there every day. So the nail brush is just to add to the kind of nail care side of uh, this gift. So get rid of those grubby paws. I've then also included some body spray and I thought it'd be kind of funny to put um, a tag around this saying something like, for those after stable shopping trips, <laughs> you know, when you go shopping and you just know people are looking at you because you just stink of horse. Yeah, well, that should help it kind of eliminate the problem. Might just mask it a little bit or not really help <laughs> at all. But yeah, the, this kind of, this present is a little bit of a, a jokey present, but it's also like just meant to be fun. And it's also just like trying to help your friends look after themselves a little bit more because I know as like myself that I don't take care of myself as well as I take care of my horse like she gets pampered like you would not believe but myself um yeah I let myself slip which is not good what else have we got in here so continuing with the pampering and the kind of like skincare routine I have like a bath bomb here and a loofah that goes really nice. Again, just trying to go with the mermaid themed colors because I know that's what she enjoys. So that's those. I actually hope there's enough room for everything in this box. We have a face mask. It's one of them like clay masks. And um, again, your face gets so dry in the winter months and you're getting battered by the elements all the time. So I thought it'd be nice to include something like this. Um, yeah, the box is like less horsey and more about skincare, which is funny because I'm not all that on skincare, but you have got like a few bits. I've included a couple of bits that are useful for down the yard, but you could, you could spice this up however you want really. This is just what I've done for my friend in particular. So these are, again, off Amazon. They are cycling gloves. And I actually have a pair of these and they are amazing. They've got like this little zip down here for easy entry. <laughs> and uh, I don't know if I can turn them inside out, but they're kind of, they're fleece lined on the inside. 
so they're really warm and they've also got grip on the hands which is obviously great for like holding on to brooms and stuff like that while you're doing your yard chores keep your hands nice and uh nice and warm also keeps them safe from the elements so when you've done all your hand and nail care you can then keep your hands nice and safe and warm and toasty and uh, away from the elements in these they're not um, 100 percent waterproof i think they say they're shower proof um but yeah they stand up to the weather really well for like next to nothing i will leave links for the stuff that i've bought off amazon i will leave links for them in the description and then the last thing is a hair mask and this is kind of to go with the brush that i got the tangle teasing brush because again your hair just gets battered by the elements and um although you're shampooing and conditioning and washing your hair and looking after it um, a mask is good just to like really get in there and uh, tame the frizz give your hair some loving <laughs> when they haven't it hasn't had loving in a while um so yeah i've got that as well okay shall we put it all together i think we should let's have a look see what we can do okay so i've got the basket in front of me i will try and make this as clear for you as possible we've got like that's the cellophane and stuff and the ribbon oh there's actually instructions on how to do the ribbon on the back that's pretty cool <clears throat> but that is for later so i guess we kind of just break this up a little bit make a little bit of mess <laughs> these are really cute actually because they've got little little hearts in them as well i'm gonna have to bless you I'm not sure he heard that. Uh, anyway, yeah, this is going to make a right mess. So I think I'm going to start with the mug because I think that'll look good at the back somewhere. This is where I write on the little card and I'm going to put something like to warm you up after a cold day the yard so yeah just something along the lines of that <laughs> then you take your string doo -doo 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 -doo. where's the end oh no oh no <laughs> and it was at that moment that she realized she messed up uh, scissors doesn't need to be too long I'll probably attach it to the handle Just attach it. It's not going to be any anything special <laughs> attachment-wise from me. But yeah, and then it's just. I'll get the GoPro so you can see. So that's how it's sitting at the moment. <clears throat> Hello. Okay, so I'm just going to keep running through the items now um, and do a little time lapse of me putting everything together. And if I have any uh, good cards that I've written out I will show you up close um, but yeah I'm just gonna crack on with this now having this stuff because you can kind of like prop the stuff in so that it doesn't keep falling down.
So this is the final product. All the lovely goodies inside. I wish so badly that I had filmed the uh, process for doing this ribbon. That's what it looks like there. But honestly, it was the easiest thing to do ever. And uh, it looks so professional. I'm really pleased with this kit. Okay, you guys, so this is it. This is the final um, product. <laughs> um, I'm really, really chuffed with this uh, purchase from Amazon, to be honest, because putting this bow together was so easy and I wish I'd filmed it, but I didn't. Uh, I just didn't. Yeah, <laughs> that's the end of that story. Um, but yeah, it was so easy to assemble. This was all easy to wrap around everything and I tied it all on my own. Everything's in there, it's all got little labels on. So yeah, I'm really hoping that they enjoy it now. Um, I've also just written on the card, uh, Equestrian Survival Kit, just uh, for the lols basically. <laughs> just to kind of, that was the whole idea behind it. So really happy with how it looks. And I hope you guys have enjoyed um, doing something a little bit different with me today. If you have any suggestions or ideas for future videos that you'd like to see for me, do leave a comment. I do take everything in and I love trying new things for people and trying to be as different as possible on this channel. So uh, yeah, if you're new here, um, don't forget you can hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so that you can be the first to know when I've uploaded a new video. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Oh, my God.